Yeah, and he gives them quality at bats consistently. Top and rips that ball, skips over the glove of Jake Lazaro. So Teal's gonna come home diving in safely for the first run of the game for the Cavaliers. He is pumped up. Rooms 11 out of 10 on the energy scale for Teal and an RBI for Alex Tappan. You know, certainly loves it there, but this is a great young coach. That ball in the dirt blocked by Teal, tagged out though. It's quick to the fence. The 0-2 pitch to Hill, and he gets him with that breaking ball on the outside. Devin Ortiz. And Brian O'Connor and Drew Dickinson are going to head to that bullpen. That ball is scorched down the right field line. Tappan's going to come all the way around to score. And a stand-up double for Ethan Anderson getting the ball down. He's got to be happy about that. Gives his team the 2-1 lead. Hit on the ground through the left side, coming home to score. O'Farrell, Teal sliding home safely. And a two RBI single for Jake Geloff opens the game. A little bit of breathing room for the Cavaliers take a 4-1 lead. At first, Mason Flaherty on the mound and squaring around to lay down the punt. Chris Newell goes to third. That ball's going to just go right past first base. Sliding in safely to third is Alex Tappan coming around to score. Devin Ortiz. Don't see if he can't get to the bottom of the zone. That ball is chopped on the infield, playing his position. Bowers fires to first for the out, and the threat is over. Big moment for the Cavaliers. They are pumped up as they head into the bottom of the sixth. Hey, the nitpicks would be the Virginia pitching against the Miami offense. Hey, with that hit, Runes, every Cavaliers got a hit in the game, an RBI single for Max Codier. Holding your breath on that. Number 55, Logan Matthew. Hits the ball to the right side. Ethan Anderson makes the play. And that's going to be the game, Runes. The third-ranked team in the country showing us how dynamic they are.